Hi guys, welcome back to another video. Today I'm going to show you how to use extended forms with Google Classroom. So here we already have a quiz in Google Forms and I'm going to start by enabling the extended forms add-on. So I'm going to click on the add-ons icon, which is this puzzle at the top of the page, then timer for Google Forms. Then I'll click on configure and we are just going to wait for this to load. Now I'll click on responses. And that will take me to the extended forms dashboard. So here's the page for our quiz and we can see the quiz responses as well as the quiz controls. Now we can add this to a Google Classroom as classwork. All we need to do is go ahead and click on this three dots, then Google Classroom, and we'll be able to select the classroom from the dropdown. But first I'll go ahead and show you guys how to add a new classroom. So you'll need to go to classroom.google.com. You'll also sign in with Google. I'm already signed in. I'll click on create class, accept the terms and continue. And at this point, you just want to go ahead and fill out this form. So I'm going to call this test class. You can also name your section. Okay. And you can also go ahead and provide the name for the subject. So I'm just going to type in general knowledge. Now let's leave room blank and we are going to click on create. All right. So once we are done, we are going to see a few prompts. Well, especially if it's your first time, you're going to see a couple of guides or mini tutorials. I'm just going to close all of them. So over here, you'll see your class code, and this could be shared with anyone. You can just go ahead and copy the invite link and share via socials, for example. At the bottom, we have upcoming for work that will be due soon. Here we have stream, which will show information about our class. We also have a classwork tab where we can find assignments. Then there's people where we can go ahead and add teachers. And this could be done by simply typing in a name or email. If you want to add students, you'll need to follow the same process. You'll also have an extra option to use an invite link. Now, finally, we have a grades tab, and this is where you can manage grades for students. All right, so now I'm going to show you guys how to add your form to Google Classroom, and we are going to go back to extended forms. So I'm just going to go ahead and click on the tab. And first, I'm going to refresh this page. Now I'm going to go ahead and click on the three dots, Google Classroom. Let's select our test class. We'll also add a title and description. Let's click add. Okay. And now we can see that we have successfully added our classwork. Now let's go to classroom. It's not in the stream as yet, but we'll go to classwork. It's right here in general, but it's also a draft. Let's click edit assignment. And here we can edit the title. We can edit the description as well. And we can also see a link to the quiz right below. We have the option as well to attach files. For example, we can add a YouTube link or maybe files from Google Drive, or we can upload anything else or a link even. Over here, we can select who it's for. We can select how many points this is worth. We have ungraded or we can go ahead and add a specific grade like 50 points. For example, we can choose the due date. So I'm just going to change this to the 21st just as an example. And right below this, we can also select a topic or create one. We also have an option to add a rubric so we can either create one, reuse one or import from sheets. Let's click on assign, assign again, and this will basically add the classwork to our stream. Let's refresh. And here's our classwork. If we click on it, we can now access our Google form via extended form. So a student would just need to log in with Google to access the quiz. Okay, so I hope this video helps. Thanks for watching and see you next time.